Good morning, friends, and happy Thursday. Woohoo! One more day at the weekend. Oh, all right, so finally sitting down to have a cup of coffee with you. As you saw, I got Casey his cereal. And uh, one more day. <laughs> He's ready for the weekend, too. <laughs> uh, so am I. <laughs> Let's get it rolling. <laughs> um, Casey wants cereal, but Henry didn't. It's like, okay, sometimes Henry doesn't get ready, I mean, hungry till later. Okay, that's fine. I go pour my cup of coffee. As I was pouring it, I'm hungry. What do you want? <laughs> Luckily, it's what's something easy, Lucky Charms. But that's a mom life. <laughs> yeah. Right as you're pouring a cup of coffee and you're about to sit down and have a chat with your friends. Yeah. <laughs> That's when he's hungry, yeah. <laughs> oh, that's okay. Uh, cereal's quick and easy. Pour it in a bowl, pour some milk, and there you go. Yeah. Oh, so if you're having a cup of coffee or tea, enjoy. Mm. It's really good today. Yeah. <laughs> oh, so. Um. Well, first of all, welcome back to my channel, Coffee with Stephanie. I'm happy that you are here. Happy that you stopped by. Um, I love uh, having coffee every morning with you guys. It is something I always look forward to. And have a little chit chat. And if this is your first time watching and you have not subscribed yet, hit that subscribe button. I'll be happy to have you and welcome you to my YouTube family. I love meeting new people, making new friends. And in this crazy upside down, trolley trolley world, more friends and more co cups of coffee, the merrier. We all need a friend or two and lots of coffee in this world. Yes, it's it's crazy 2021 so far and it just, I think, keeps getting crazier. <laughs> I don't know. Mm. Oh, yeah, so hit that subscribe button. I'll be happy to have you. I love seeing my channel grow. Love me new people. There's just something about it, meaning like making new friends, and it just puts a pep in your step. You're happy, you know, and yeah, so hit that subscribe button. Yeah. And don't forget to hit like and comment down below because I do, I love commenting. I love comments. I love the interaction. That's the part I always look forward to is interaction, and I just love it. You know, makes my day. It really does. Ooh. So does coffee. <laughs> oh, yeah. So um, I think the boys have online learning. I um, haven't heard anything. So uh, I did get a message from Casey's teacher just talking about report cards. They will be emailed out on Monday, which I figured that's what would happen. But she kind of explained, you know, the system. Um, a because it's going to be letter grade so it's going to be a b c or d or you know and plus and minus that kind of thing and then r you know which i don't know why they use r because r is just it's you know what r stands for obviously <laughs> like I, I i i i don't know maybe it's using f offensive you know um, i don't know but they, they use r instead so um yeah so i don't know I, it'll be interesting to see because i know it has been a hard year you know with this um pandemic and so we'll see yeah <laughs> i don't um, really i don't know it could go either way you know i i think they're doing good but you know obviously learning at home on a computer versus in a class does affect them and would make a difference so yeah we'll see mm. But that's Monday, yeah. And then, yeah, like I said in yesterday's vlog, if you watched yesterday's vlog, they are going back to school on Monday. It was announced yesterday. And well, hello there, Miss Lowe, as you come to say hello. There's no birdies or squirrels yet, sorry. Um, that's how she makes her appearance. Here's my tail. <laughs> Peekaboo Flowers. <Lois. laughs> uh, uh, it's kind of like work. It's kind of like finding Waldo, but you know, finding Lois. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What are you doing? So, yeah, they are going back to school, and so I have to get all of their stuff together, their school supplies, because when they came home right before Christmas break, they had a week online learning right before Christmas break, and then after Christmas break, it's been online learning since then. So, they came home with everything, 
I pretty much um, have some stuff in their bags. There's some stuff on the table right here behind behind you guys. Yeah. And there's some stuff on the table over there. So I want to try and get ahead of that and, you know, so I'm not running around like a crazy lady and get everything together. Yeah. And they're going into indoor shoes. Um, and, oh boy, I don't think they're the one shoes that they had, outdoor shoes. I think they have outgrown those. So I have to see if I have running shoes for them. Yeah, so okay. Well, if not, I'll have to get, I'll get them some that little problem. Yeah, so we got, we got to do all that. We have to get ready for Monday and it's going to kick us in the butt because, you know, we've been kind of sleeping in, you know? Like, yeah, like, like we suck it up early, but... You know, we sleep in like an extra 30 minutes, you know, and come Monday, it's like, yeah, that's going to kick us in the butt, you know, and like really, we haven't been on a school schedule. Yeah, they have to be signed in by 8.30 or like, usually it's like between 8.25 and 8.30 and it's like, oh, you know, we have to do the hustle and the bustle. In the morning, you know, get dressed, brush your teeth, get your shoes on, get your stuff on, hats, coats, gloves, and out the door you go. Uh, yeah, <laughs> by a certain time. Um, so yeah, we'll see how Monday goes. We may be late. We'll see. <laughs> Who knows? I don't know. That's what I think, because it's been, it's been, um, two months since we've had to do that. So, yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right, so if you're new here, this is our fur kid, Lois, who likes to watch for birds and squirrels, but there are none. I don't know where they are. And there's still a bird seed out there. It's just all on the ground. They dumped it all out. Yeah. But they have to wait a couple more days, so. Yeah. I don't feel it. Like, I, I only fill it up once a week because... If I kept filling it up like that, like, I wouldn't be able to afford to keep bird seed on hand. You know, even at the good deal, the good deal I get at Costco for a big bag for fifteen nine nine. You know, it's like they're pigs, and I know I'm not the only one that feeds them in the neighborhood. We have neighbors that feed them too, so yeah, they're well taken taken care of. If our bird feeders are out, you know, I'm sure somebody else's bird feeders are full, so they can wait a couple days. Yeah. Oh, uh, because then it's like I'm going to be constantly filling them up, but I, I don't want to. Oh, once a week is enough. Uh, mm. Yeah, so Monday will be interesting. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> yeah. Very interesting. Yeah. Oh, I know. And they have to get dressed. <laughs> because they, they've been in their PJs, you know, and for like, you know, two months and that's all they worn, you know, every time they got dressed or like got changed, you know, they just all clean pair of PJs, you know, they've been in their PJs for like two months, yeah, and um, um well, so, so have I, you know, I, I think I only got dressed, you know, sometimes, like, a few times, especially like if I had to go to the store, okay, I got dressed, but yeah, I'm like, I want a PJ too, a PJ day, you know? <laughs> mm. So that's gonna be hard, yeah, so you have to yeah, get dressed. And every time I'd fold laundry, I would just fold their jammies, I wouldn't be folding, you know, regular clothes. Oh, and I was texting my friend, because uh, her, her kids are in a, like, we're in the same situation with all I learning, and her, her kids have been there. Jeremy's <laughs> and I have her one son he's in kindergarten and he doesn't he likes he likes playing at home he doesn't want to go back to school he likes playing at home I'm like yeah I don't blame him I know and in a weird way it's like even though I know it's like good for them to go back but it's gonna feel so weird because like they've been home for two months so it's gonna feel really weird not having them home <laughs> I know yeah <laughs> I mean, I, I, I guess it gives me a chance to like really work um organizing our bedroom and when it comes time to painting it, you know, I won't have any interruptions. Um, yeah, so I can get it painted and, you know, they'll be at school, but like, it will be weird because I'm so used to having them home 
you know, with me all day. So, yeah, but it will be a nice break. It will be. Yeah, it's kind of a little bit of both. You know, I'm going to miss them, but I am looking forward to a break. So, yeah. <laughs> mm. All right, I'm going to finish this delicious cup of coffee, which is almost gone. I'm telling you, it does not last long when it's this delicious. And I hope everyone has a wonderful Thursday. I have to make my shopping list. I gotta do that today. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. I know I need milk. I always need milk. Milk and I have got another ketchup bottle. We just opened one, but that won't last a week. So I go through ketchup like crazy. Mmm. Not a thing. Oh, I probably need cat food. Yeah. Yeah, kitty food. And yeah. I'll start that, start doing that today. All right, so I hope everyone has a great day, and um, I will check back in. I'm assuming they have online, and hopefully the Wi-Fi is fixed. I hope so by now. Um, but it did work in our favor yesterday. Yeah, it was. It was actually, you know what? It was an. It, it was a. I needed a break. It was nice to have a break, and they did do their homework, um, which you know, was hard just to get them to do their homework, but they did it. Um, but. You know, it was nice. It was nice to have a break because online learning is tiring, it's stressful, it's frustrating, and you know, yesterday morning was one of those mornings where I, I wanted to chuck the computer out the window. You know, like hey, bye bye, sorry, Lara. You know, like, yeah, yeah. So huh, good thing they're coming back Monday. You know, yeah, <laughs> for my sanity, that is. Yeah. Mm. It's not what it's cracked up to be, no. Some kids excel at it. Some kids do excellent uh, online learning, but my kids just, no, uh, they don't. <laughs> they they need to be in class with the teacher and less less distractions. Yeah, there's just too many distractions at home, and yeah, you just don't want to sit still. You don't want to pay attention. You don't want to do your work, you know? And they eventually do, but there's just some mornings where it's hard to get them situated. Okay, sit, pay attention, but yeah. Anyways, we only have today and tomorrow, thank goodness. All right, so I hope everyone has a wonderful day. I am going to um, finish this up and, uh, yeah, get these boys situated. And they're already fed, so <laughs> probably just have to get them signed, signed on and, uh, yeah, get them all set up. All right, so um, I'll check back in. Well, change of plans for today. Um, I was not planning on going out today, but I'm going to get my coat on. I'm going to take you guys shopping with me because we are going to go grocery shopping one day early. I usually go on Fridays and the only time I don't go on a Friday if it's like a holiday like um, Christmas. I couldn't like that. I couldn't go because Christmas was on a Friday and then Christmas Eve was on a Thursday. And so I think I went on a Wednesday, you know, so it throws off my schedule for grocery shopping when it's like I can't go on a Friday. Um, but um, tonight, I guess we are supposed to get snow. So, um, yeah, <laughs> um, they're calling for a good amount between five and ten centimeters. So I'm going to play it safe and get groceries one day early just in case because like even though we, we do live really close to town and really close to no frills it doesn't matter the distance i do not like driving on icky slicky slippery snowy roads and uh, no like a lot of people don't right um so even if we don't get you know the, the snowstorm they're saying we're going to get and it's supposed to start around 5 6 and continue snowing until 2 a.m so even if we don't get um all of it or like because like you know sometimes we only get half of it or it passes us you know so you never know <laughs> and an old man winter you know keeps us on our toes so um i'm going to get the shopping done a day early and even if they don't you know even if it's you know it turns out to be okay in the morning oh well that's okay i got i got the shopping done a day early so yeah <laughs> i just um I like being prepared and, you know, if it's going to be snowing out, yeah, I don't want to go out in that weather. So I'm going to zip up my coat and I'll take you guys with me. Yeah, we'll go snow frills, get those groceries one day early, but that's okay. Um, so I might think it's Friday today. I know because I'll, I'll, I end up confusing myself when I go on a Thursday. I start thinking it's Friday. So, yeah. <laughs> All right. 
bag is stuck on the handle. <laughs> All right, so let's get our shopping on. Not too cold. Thought it'd be colder. So I do have a list. I did make a list before I got ready. And the boys are on their lunch. And yeah, I'm just glad online schooling is almost done. <laughs> oh, no, I'm done with it right now. Like. This morning, I had to sit next to Casey just so he would do what they were working on. They were working on, um, well, they were learning about the groundhog. And, and uh, so they were writing um, down, you know, different facts about the groundhog, um, what they can do, what they have, you know, there go my keys. <laughs> Uh, gloves. They get in the way. <laughs> um, yeah, like what, what they have and what they are. You know, they're a mammal. Um, and what they can do, like hibernate and what they, what they eat, that kind of stuff. So, but he had to write that down, and I had to sit next to him so he would, you know, write it down. So, um, needless to say, I think we're all done with online learning. It's like, hey, bye bye, nice knowing you. Don't come back, <laughs> you know? Yeah. <laughs> all right, so let's go. I'm gonna buckle up. I gotta fix my seat first. I can always tell when the hubby drives. <laughs> all right, and we will buckle up and be on our way. Yeah. All right, let's go. Um, I think a lot of people had the same idea because the parking lot is a little bit busier than it should be for Thursday. Yes, so um, here we go. <laughs> Thank goodness I'm done. It was quite crazy in there. And yeah, I'm gonna pack these groceries up. And let's make a quick pit stop to Dollar Rama. I want to get some bread there. And uh, <laughs> coming out, crush chips. Anyone? I ran, I ran them over. They uh, fell out the cart. And oh, the bag popped. <laughs> Uh-huh. They're still good. Just have to. They're for Sunday for the Super Bowl, so I just have to um put a clip on them. But yeah, that's how my Thursday's going. How's your Thursday going? <laughs>
All right, all done with Dollarama. Um, of course, I, you know, got more than I intended to. Of course, you knew that though, right? <laughs> uh, but uh, yeah, they uh, saw me coming. <laughs> oh, so um, I'm gonna head home. Oh, it's gonna be so good. Mm. Okay. And, um, yeah, get some lunch, do a haul. <laughs> yeah, that's why, you know, you shouldn't go shopping when you're hungry because you pick up chocolate bar. It's a new one, though. It's a uh, cookie dough, Kit Kat, crunchy. Mm, sorry, crunchy. <laughs> Kit Kat, chunky. <laughs> uh, cookie dough. I remember. When these used to be in peanut butter, and they were so, so good. I loved them. But you can't find them anymore. I don't know if they stopped making them. Oh, so I'm going to try this one. And these won't be as good as my mom's. But I'm like, you know what? Those look good. I think they're $1.75. A couple of fire tarts. Because, um, you know, when you're waiting in line and you're looking at the stuff they have right there on the shelf. Just so you go like this and grab. Yeah, that's what I did. <laughs> no. It's like, oh, that looks good. Oh, that looks good. Oh, my cookie, my cookie dough chocolate bar broke. That's sad. Oh, that smells good. You can see the cookie dough. Mmm. Mm. Oh, wow. That is so cool. How do they do that? Really? I'm curious. Oh, yeah. Because you have your Kit Kat right here. I mean, a cookie dough. Is it just a cookie right there? Mm hmm. Mm. That is neat. Mm. Good. It's the best of both worlds cookie and chocolate. Yeah. <laughs> uh huh. Mm. That is good. Mm. I just realized I'm looking through the window. The last time I went to Dollarama, I got Sour Patch and there were bunnies in the shape of bunnies. They were just randomly lying on a shelf and I grabbed, I just grabbed one and then I went back the next day because I forgot something, of course, that always happens. And the other one was still lying there and I grabbed it. I'm looking at the end cap here. They're right there hanging on the end cap of the Easter Sour Patch yeah, candy. And it's a big bag, but I got two because that's like one of our favorite candies. Sour Patch. Yeah. Mm -hmm. oh. Yep. Yeah. So, huh, that's funny. Oh, there they are. <laughs> uh. Oh, that's my mom! <laughs> she just came out of Dollarama. Hang on, hold on. Hang on. Hey! So that was my mom. <laughs> um, I talked to her this morning on the phone too, and um, she uh, mentioned she had to go to Dollarama, um, and she uh, made spaghetti, and it's still warm, still warm. Oh, yep. So she would have dropped that off. So hey, I got it from her now, and uh, she also had my my um, the words. Uh, for scriptures for your daily Bible reading, so kind of like you know, um, like devotions, yeah. So I got that, I got that. <sighs> okay, even though Alabama is busy, so I think I made the right choice. And even my mom was gonna go pick up some stuff at No Girls, you know. So yeah, I think I made the right choice, even though, like, um, somebody. Um, and the line at Dollar uh, Dollarama said, oh, we probably won't get that much. But it's like, you know, you never know. Like, that's why it's been happening a lot. Like, yeah, we haven't been getting a lot. We've just been getting, like, a dusting. But, you know what? I'm not taking the chance. <laughs> it's better safe than sorry. So, yeah. Mm. I know I, I had my keys in my pocket. And when I saw her, I accidentally locked my door. So I'm like, oh, wait, wait, you know, <laughs> um, I, I was trying to get the window down. That's what I was trying to do. And, um, yeah, I accidentally locked the door. <laughs> yeah. Oh, 
of all the times not to have my keys in the yeah, ignition. Oh well. But it worked out. Alright, I'm gonna finish this and go home and do a grocery haul. Mm. Have lunch. <laughs> um I'll do a Dollarama haul supper. Mm -hmm. So let's go do that. All right, let's get to that grocery haul and I'll go and try and speed it up because my vlog is already, <laughs> it's already long. Ooh, a lot going on today. Um, all right, so apple juice, $1.47. It says the kids are going back Monday to school. Um, juice boxes, $4.00. Uh, I did get 600 PC points for apple juice drinks, so yay me! <laughs> yeah, that was nice. And potatoes were $4.97, but I got 1600 PC points for these, so yeah, I like those kind of points. Yeah. Let's toss those down there. <laughs> and Kleenex uh, for the six boxes, that was on sale for three something. I think it's like 377. Yeah, 377. That's good because we just took out our last box, so that was perfect time. Alright, I'm gonna grab more stuff and I'll probably start with the freezer stuff. Here's my crush bag of Tostito chips that I ran over with a cart and it went pop. <laughs> They're still good though. Not quite a few. A few, but they're, they're still good. Yeah, there you go. Damage. <laughs> and honestly, when I heard the noise, I thought it was the juice that fell. Because it was like that kind of sound. I thought, because I had the juice on the bottom of the cart. I thought, oh, it's the juice. It's the juice boxes. Nope, it was the chip. So that sound was the bag popping. <laughs> so this is where a clip <laughs> comes in handy. And I'm going to put these in the back because this is for Super Bowl Sunday. And it shows you how much you get and how much is here, right? Quite a difference. Alright, so I also got milk, which has gone up almost 20 cents. And it hasn't gone up in a long time, but it's probably with everything that's going on. Because um, it was, oh, last week when I bought it, it was $4.49. Now it's $4.67. So, yeah. <laughs> All right, so uh, next up, just a uh, small butter. Basel, it was still $1.88, so I just grabbed it. Um, chicken nuggets were still on sale of jeans for $4.97. I just grabbed one box because I still have half of the big box I bought last week. And of course, chicken balls, $11.97. Uh, shredded cheese, I need this for doing an appetizer for Super Bowl, uh, $5. And of course, I will show you, I will film. I will film when I do that. Um, Two dollars for no name corn, uh, corn peas, and PC corn was on sale. Uh, let me see, three forty-seven, and I think they're usually like three ninety-seven, somewhere around there at no frills. Okay, so okay. Uh, okay, um, ham, lunch meats, smoked honey maple flavor, so that sounds really good, $5, and hot dogs, a big pack, eight forty seven. dollars this will last me two weeks, I think I still have a, a few left from the, the other pack I got two weeks ago, um, probably like, like maybe like this much, you know, like that much left. So it does last, so that's why I've been buying the big party pack, because it lasts us um, a little bit longer, two weeks. <sighs> yes, trying to make it stretch, right? All right, let me put the frozen stuff away and I'll be right back. All right, um, <clears throat> cucumbers, $4.97. Um, cheaper to buy them in a pack like this, because for one cucumber, they want $1.67. And the kids go through these like crazy. I still have a couple in the fridge, but those won't last a whole week. <laughs> no. <laughs> All right. Bananas. Um, I have my assistant here. <laughs> She's snooping. Actually, I did not need any cat food. I had enough in the cupboard. So, yeah. 
All right. Let me see. What am I looking for? <laughs> uh, produce. Okay, so bananas were a dollar and three cents. And let me see. Yeah, all right. Uh, let, lettuce, iceberg. 247. Oh, you, whoops. That's on the floor. <laughs> usually, when it's that price, because like 247 is a lot, I usually try to grab the biggest one. But they were all tiny. They were all small. So, they're like, all right. Uh, so, oh, where'd it go? Oh, okay. <laughs> there she is. <laughs> I'm losing my head. Yeah. <laughs> uh, all right, um, let me put the bananas over here. Uh, coleslaw, $1.97. It's good till February 17th. They had some that were almost like expired, I think like next week. I always try to pick one with a good expiry date. And I think there are two, let me see, 247 or 297. 277 for uh, beef steak tomatoes. All right, let me grab some more stuff. All right, um, also to go with Super Bowl, they're two dollars, so old Dutch ripple. I'm gonna put those in the back. Uh, and these were four dollars, they were two dollars off. I vlogged some of it, and um, I'm going to put them in the back for next. Because yeah. if I don't, they'll be gone, and I kind of want them for like, you know what, <laughs> B-Day, yeah. So those are going to go in the back right now. Okay. <laughs> Mom, Mom is sneaky. That's right. They have to be when they're home. Yeah. All right, we have been loving this yogurt PC, 477. It will last me, even with the boy seeing it. Um, almost like two weeks. So I have been getting that because you get four vanilla, four raspberry, four strawberry, and four banana. Um, and they have like two different kinds. There's one where you get like blueberry, and I think vanilla, and maybe strawberry, and another one is apple, which is actually really good. Yeah. So $4.77 for that. Okay. Let's see. Alright. Um, I found a lot of stuff, well, a few stuff anyways, um, <laughs> that's a lot to me, um, that was 50% off, and, let me see, okay, so, hi, can you help, she's right here, eh? <laughs> she's like, oh, there goes something else on the floor, there she is. Hey, say hi. <laughs> oh, I'm just knocking everything over. That's what I do best. Yep, drop stuff, knock stuff over. All right, um, ravioli, cheese, and spinach. They were $3.97, so 50% off. Uh, they came to like $1.98. So I got two of them, and I always, you know, check the expiry dates, you know, especially when it's 50% off. And they expire on February 14th, Valentine's Day. So I'm going to use this for Valentine's Day dinner and kind of do a lasagna um, dish, you know, pretty much. Let's, you know, you know, if you know lasagna, instead of using the lasagna noodles, you use these. So that's what I'm going to do with that. And probably do something else for the boys, maybe like um, pita pizzas, but like kind of like what I did for Halloween. I did go shape, I used to use a cookie cutter. Um, so I'll probably, you know, do that if I can't find, um, pizza dough and shape it into a heart, because that's what I did last year, and I do have a heart, uh, cookie cutter, so, um, yeah, so, I'll probably do pizza, because I, I, I don't know if we would eat this, um, Casey might try it, but, you know, it's one of those things where it's like, mm, you know, not 100% sure. Alright, and eggs were 2 84 I grabbed two, You're ready. and I, I got my bread at Dollarama because they want two forty-seven. Mm -hmm. And it's like, well, I can go to Dollarama and get a bigger loaf 
for two dollars. So dollar ram it was. That's where I got my bread, but I did get um let's see the price. Alright, so I found the price. Uh, I bought um white bread. This is really good to have toasted, so um two eighty seven. Been a while since I had bread like that. Very good and really good for sandwiches too. And uh, let me see, because my mom, <laughs> we have spaghetti, but we'll probably have that tonight. Um, garlic bread. Yeah, that's what this is called. Garlic bread. <laughs> like, oh, my brain, we just went on vacation for there for a second. Uh, that was on sale for two something, two forty seven. And then hot dog buns, two twenty seven. So that's the only bread I got because I still have bagels in the freezer, so I'm still good for that. And I got the bread I needed at Dollarama. All right, uh, mac and cheese original was on sale for a dollar, so I grabbed four. We just had the last box last night for dinner. Uh, oatmeal, um, dollar eighty-eight, actually on sale. And. I needed pasta, so spaghetti. Um, I still have enough, but I am running low, so I like having me you know, noodles in stock. Um, elbow macaroni, and these are all a dollar. And then those ones. Routini. Routini. Alright, so all a dollar, great price. <laughs> Almost done. Almost. All right, um, my creamer was on sale and No Frills had my flavor. They don't always have my flavor. Southern Butter Pecan, $3.97. And salsa, I need this for the appetizer, um, $2. And I grabbed another ketchup, $4.47. This is man's country, and let's face it, Ugh. we're just kids. All right, so, uh, I want to do um, kind of a, like pulled pork sandwiches but with a roast beef because I got a couple of small roast beefs and the freezer that they were like around four dollars they were like really cheap uh, I think I bought them last month so I wanted to get some buns <laughs> hot buns <laughs> um, I don't know how, let me see they were like I think they were three something but you got 12 so there was another one that was two something but you only got six so let me see. Bakery. Uh, 367. So not too too bad. Icing. Dollar 97. We need that for something. And the last two 50% offs was um, a creamy chicken and vegetable pie. And oh, the expiry date is February 6th. So two days from now, we can have this tomorrow no. night if we don't have, like, because we have spaghetti tonight, and if there's not enough spaghetti for um, leftovers, then we'll have this tomorrow night, and if there's not enough, um, I mean, if there is enough spaghetti, we can, okay, if the, <laughs> I'm confusing myself, if there's enough spaghetti tomorrow night for leftovers, we can have this Saturday night. Right, um, but if there's not a, not, not a lot of leftovers, see, I'm thinking it's Friday. I'm confusing myself. I know, because I'm a grocery shopping a day early because um, of the stinking if we get a storm. Um, yeah, anyways, I'm lost. So <laughs> it was $5, 50% off, so it was $2.50. Um, okay, so we have spaghetti tonight, and if there's enough leftovers, We'll have spaghetti tomorrow night, but if there's not enough leftovers for spaghetti, um, we'll have this tomorrow night. Yes. And I figure out what to have Saturday. Okay. <laughs> uh, I'm just confusing myself. I really am. I am. Okay. All right. So, yeah, two. Uh, that was five bucks, but two fifty, fifty percent off. And another 50% off. They have been doing, like, uh, I'm, I'm loving seeing these nice pink, bright you know, labels, 50% off. Um, this was also $5, but 50% off, it was $2.50. So you get two marble and um, 
I don't know. What's that one? Golden. That's what I'm trying to think of. Golden. Uh, it expires on the 6th, but this will be gone. It's just like muffins. It'll be gone before you know it. Yeah. This would be really good. Put some butter on there. Mm. Yeah. And plus, you know, it'll, probably, it'll still be good. Yeah. Alright, so that's, that's it. I believe so. Oh, hang on. Um, they had their pops on sale, the 750 millimeter ones, um, two forty-seven, um, and I just grabbed two of the ginger ale because we still have a Coke that we bought last week, and, um, even if I wanted to grab a Coke, I couldn't because I didn't have any, so, that's just fine. Alright, that's it, um, at No Frills, let me see, one fifty-one forty-three cents, and that's all in Canadian dollars. Alright, so, yeah, that's it. I'm going to go Bipsy Poppy Boo and put this stuff away. <laughs> and i got to do a dollar in my haul, so I'm going to take a break before I do that. Alright, so dinner is served. Oh, it's really good. <laughs> mm -hmm. mm, mom's spaghetti. Nothing like mom's home cooking. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm. So, uh, no snow yet, still waiting. <laughs> Although, they did say around 5, 6 o'clock. It's around, well, 5.30 right now. So. But, even if they, you know, were wrong on the amount we were supposed to get, you know, that's fine. Because I'm glad I went shopping and got out of the way. One less thing to do tomorrow. <laughs> mm hmm mm. Mm. Oh, it's so good. Mm. Love it. <laughs> Plus, I didn't have to cook it, so bonus. Yeah, I know. And actually, we should have enough leftovers for tomorrow. Mm hmm. Mm. Mm hmm. Oh, that's good. All right, I'm going to finish this and enjoy every single bite and just keep waiting for that snow to come. <laughs> mm hmm. Mm. Alright, so I hope everyone had a wonderful Thursday. I'll see you tomorrow, Friday. Woohoo! Yay! We made it. The boys have homework, but it's not too much. Just Google Classroom. Um, and Henry has to go over his words for the week because he has another word study quiz, you know, aka spelling test. <laughs> um, but I just, I just went over them with him and he got them all right. But I also want him to write, write them out because that's good practice too. And that makes it, you know, you get, you get stuck in your head, right? You memorize it. Yeah. So, we're going to do that later. I'm going to do the homework right after I'm done eating this because when it gets to be too late, like a, like it's not late, you know, but, you know, when we do it, like say an hour before bedtime, yeah, they get cranky and it's harder to get them to do their homework and it gets done, but um, believe me, it's not easy. Uh, so, after I'm done eating this, it's going to be homework time for them. We're going to start around 6 o'clock. Mm-hmm. Last night we got got to it a little bit late and I was like, oh, okay, never doing that again. <laughs> Wanna prevent that if I can. <laughs> uh huh. But they're tired and they're cranky, so. Mm -hmm. and the last thing you want to do is your homework. <laughs> mm -hmm. Alright, so um, I'll see you guys tomorrow morning with a cup of coffee. And maybe some more snow. We'll see. <laughs> All right. So um, have a great night. Take care. Be blessed and be kind. Okay. Bye.